Looks like this is the last chance for Salengo to win the match. Salengo will lose the Independence Cup if Ivan fails to score this goal. Looks like Ivan's trying to calm himself before taking the shot. Nightmare. It scared me out to death. Bye, Dad. Bye, Mom. Bye, Grandpa. I'll miss you all. Bye, Mom. I'll make sure I return with the cup. Bye, everyone. You do your best, Ivan. I know you can do it, son. You be careful, Ivan. Don't you be naughty. Sure. I'll be okay, Mom. I wonder if we're gonna visit the zoo. I wonder if we'll go to the museum. I wonder if we're gonna meet any girls. attendance now. It's time to go visit some of the famous spots in Kuala Lumpur. The first is right here. It's obviously the famous Kuala Lumpur Tower. It's the fifth largest tower in the world. Its height reaches 421 meters and it was built in 1995. The KL Tower. Oh, this is my first time seeing such a tall tower. Okay, let's go and buy the admission tickets now. Come on.
remind me not to get in trouble. <laughs> wow, Trichaya! <laughs> Jeez. Okay, here we are. This is our hostel. We will be staying here throughout the entire tournament. Oh yeah, we're not the only team staying here. The other two Malaysian representatives, Perak as well as Negri Simbalan. So, you guys try and get along with each other, okay? You got it, coach. Now, take your bags upstairs to your rooms. There will be two to a room. Try and get some rest. And later, I'll call a team meeting. I need to tell you all the team draw and match schedules. Okay, okay coach. <laughs> wow! This room is really cool. It has air conditioning and everything. <laughs> hey, Ivan, I can see a huge football pitch through the window. I can see some people training right now. Come on, let's go take a look. No thanks, man. I think I'll hang out here. Uh, uh, what on earth are you doing? Come on, Ivan. You're the team captain. You can't afford to get lazy. Come on! which team they belong to. They look really impressive. Yeah, that's right. Their passes are right on the spot. Uh -huh. Hey, Felix, did you hear that? I thought I heard a really annoying laugh that sounded really familiar. I don't hear anything at all, Ivan. I wondered who was trying to sneak a look at our training. Well, if it isn't Felix the Stupid and Ivan the Weak. <laughs> How on earth did you manage to get in here? Did you think that Selangor was the only team in Malaysia? Now I'm representing the Parak Under-12 team. Oh. So these are the Selangor players that you were telling me about? Yep. Don't worry, they're rubbish. <laughs> a Parak player? But isn't he... Without me, uh, the Selangor team doesn't stand a single chance in this Independence Cup tournament. So why don't you just sit on the bench and watch me as I hold up the Independence Cup after the finals? Come on, let's go. Bye-bye, loser. <laughs> we have to tell the rest of our team. Ah, uh, Ivan, I've been looking all over for you. What's the matter, coach? This is the team draw for the entire Independence Cup tournament. Here, take a look. Thanks a lot, coach. How many teams are there? Which group does Parag belong to? There are a total of three groups, and each group has three teams. Our team will be meeting Team Payao in the very first game. How cool is that? Yes, the Payao team has a very strong defense tactic, and they're also quick in their counterattacks. Our team's going to have to be alert in this match. No room for errors. Yeah. What's the matter with you guys? Ivan, you're the team captain. Why don't you tell me what's going on? Uh, coach, earlier on we bumped into Bobby. He's playing for the Perak team now. Oh, actually I had heard that Bobby was going to try out for the teams of several other states just to try his luck. So, he's playing for Perak, huh? <laughs> so tell me, is that why you're all so tense? You don't want to face Bobby again? As a football player, you must not be afraid to face any kind of team. It doesn't matter how strong they are, you must always gather your courage and face them. Yeah, guys, the coach is right. We can't be afraid to face any teams. It's true, huh? Ivan. There's no use in worrying like this. The tournament starts tomorrow, dude. Yeah. We'll meet any challenges along the way head on. Welcome to Stadium Merdeka. I'm Zachary Abrams, and next to me is Arthur Baker. So, what is your view of this year's tournament? Thank you, Zachary. Most people don't understand the significance of the Independence Cup Under-12 tournament, but it is actually very important. 
These young athletes are the future of football for these countries. The challenges that these kids will have to go through will prepare them for future tournaments, such as the World Youth Football Cup, which is known for its stiff competition. Thanks a lot, Arthur. All right, the Independence Cup will begin shortly after this opening ceremony. As we can see, all the participating teams are entering onto the field. What we can see now are the football teams from our neighboring country, Singapore. The first team to enter the field is the Tampanese team, followed by the Geelong team. Both of these teams are well known for their strong offensive strategies and should not be underestimated. The next teams are the Bengkulu and Jambi teams from Indonesia. Both these teams are notorious for their creative attack tactics. The other two teams also competing in this Independence Cup tournament are Pai Yao and Rayong from Thailand. Three teams from Malaysia managed to qualify for the tournament this time. The first team is from Perak, followed by Negri Sembilan and Selangor. The first match between Selangor and Payao will begin shortly after the national anthem is played. Oh my gosh, there's so many people. My knees are shaking. How am I going to do this? Ivan, I'm really scared. I'm nervous. Relax. Just try not to think about it. Just focus all your attention on what you have to do. How can Felix be so calm? I can't even bring myself to look at the audience in the stadium. All right. All the teams are just leaving the field now. The first match between Selangor and Payao will begin in five minutes. I can't wait to see what these two teams have got to show us. Huddle up, guys. Okay, this is your first ever match in a tournament. I want you to play with everything you've got and don't give any chances to your opponents. This is a time to do or die. Got it? Got it, coach. Samuel, you're going to be benched for the time being. Later in the match, I'll sub you in when the time is right. You got it? OK, coach. Now, get out on that field and show them what you got. Yes, yes coach. coach. Looks like the kickoff belongs to the Payao team. OK, let's show them what we've got. Come on, guys, let's get our first win. Yeah! Sean, uh? don't rush off to the goal. They'll be offside. The coach said their defense is quite strong. No need to fear. I can break through any team's defense, no matter how strong. All right, the match is about to begin. The Payao team gets the first attack. They're trying to play it safe. Let's steal the ball from them and score an early first goal. Come on, you guys. Let's show them what we're all made of. <laughs> uh, hey, what on earth are you guys up to? Are you too chicken to attack? Looks like Payao is playing with caution. They're not attacking and are just holding the ball on their half of the field. What are they up to? They're not attacking at all. Huh? Oh no! Something's not right. Everyone's moved forward. Since the start of the match, Payao has been passing the ball backwards, and they've had no intention of attacking. The ball is in Christopher's hands now. What will Payao's team huh? captain do? Oh, Selangor, you fools. You've all been fooled by my trap. <laughs> Attack! Huh? We've been tricked. <laughs> Everything's destined. We're sure to win. The <laughs> ball is back with Christopher. What will he do now? Why do this? defensive players failed to steal the ball? Selangor is in grave danger now. Oh no! This is bad! Ugh. A good chance! The Selangor goalkeeper is running forward from his goal post. Christopher shoots! Oh no! He wasn't trying to score! Go! Go! Payo has taken the lead with a 1 to 0 goal. The match has only just begun three minutes ago, and Payao is already leading. A very well-planned counter-attack by the Thai team. 
Their counterattack was really fast. Boy, that was a stupid move by us. Huh. Ivan, don't you guys give up out there? Try and even up the score. There's still plenty of time left. We've still got a lot of time left. The coach is absolutely right. Come on, Sean, let's even up the score. All right. is just too tight! Felix! Uh, I've got to pass the ball to the front. Uh, let's go for it again! Uh, uh, yeah! They're not attacking at all! They're only defending their own half! How are we supposed to get into the penalty box? We better keep control of the ball! This isn't good at all. I've got to think of a backup plan. Yes! The first half has just ended. Payao is leading 1-0. Slango barely created any chances to score on goal. What's your opinion, Zachary? I think Selangor also definitely change their tactics. If this situation continues, Payao will win this game. The Selangor players have not even been able to enter Payao's penalty box. I don't want you guys to give up. We still have 45 minutes left in this game. But coach, we couldn't break through their tight defenses at all. All their players are playing defensively and have no intention of attacking. It's almost impossible to get a score. At least two or three of the players have already marked me. I don't have any space to run at all. Hmm. From the very start of the match, I had a funny feeling that something was wrong. They were only passing the ball backwards and you all kept on chasing. So when they start to counter attack, our half is exposed since all of you guys have moved forward. It's really pretty clever. Exposed? Forward? <gasps> guys, I got an idea. Huh? 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 You guys, I have an excellent idea. Let's shoot from a distance. The second half begins now. The question is, can Salango get an equalizer? Here, Ivan, take the ball. Payao are shaping the defense very quickly. Is Salango thinking of a new strategy? Now the ball is controlled by Slango's team captain, Ivan. What will he do? <laughs> it doesn't matter how many times you try for an attack. You'll never get through our team's incredible defense. Sean! It looks like everyone's getting tired. We're running out of time. I have to do something quick. The referee calls for a corner kick. All right, this is our chance. We've got to take this opportunity and make sure we score a goal. We have to score from this corner kick. This is our last chance for a goal. But what should I do? Ivan! Take this, pal! Goal! Salanga have got their equalizer in the 88th minute. Payao defense has failed with two minutes to go in the match. Samuel! Yes, coach? Now I think it's our turn to do a counterattack. There's only two minutes left in the game, and the rest of the team looks tired. You've got to run as fast as you can and score a goal for us, son. Attack! What? Samuel! Yeah. 
Not only am I quick, I'm also fresh. You'll never be able to catch me. Eat my dust, dude. <laughs> yeah! Oh, it hit the goalpost. We still got a chance. Yeah! Goal, goal! <laughs> Selengo has scored a goal in the last dying moments. 2-2-1. It's over, Selengo!